All right, guys, so we got loaded in uh, Wendell, just north of Creston, and we're supposed to unload this 7 a.m. We're gonna try to get it unloaded today. I don't know if they'll do it or not, but we're definitely gonna show up and see. I'm not sure if they close at two or three, but we should be there around 1.30ish. So hopefully they unload us. Might give a good surprise to dispatch. Surprise! We're empty. We're next. And that was with a 20 minute road closure on Kootenai Pass. And they were doing avalanche control there, so... Bit of a bumpy road here. Oh, what am I talking about? We were in Manitoba. These roads are beautiful. These bumps just want, want to throw me halfway across the lane. Manitoba, the bumps wanted to throw me off the highway. It is definitely feeling like spring. It's beautiful. Plus 10. 10 kilometers to Fruitvale. We have to go... The address is Fruitvale where we're headed. But we have to drive through, through, through Fruitvale, drive to the outskirts of Trail, and then turn south, and then head up some steep climbs, short little steep climbs, to our destination, which is addressed in Fruitvale. But got to go all the way to Trail and then come back. Yeah, it's weird. It's really close to the Trail Airport. Yeah, it's plus, plus 10, like I said. So I've been running with the window open a lot. It kind of feels good. Feels good to be warm again. dog is behaving, the owner of the dog is behaving, vehicles are behaving, we're all good. Looks like there used to be a gas station there. Historic site ahead. The gas station? <laughs> Unlikely. <clears throat> See a little log cabin there with a plaque on it. I'm gonna guess that after we unload Fruitvale, we're gonna get a load at Kleshnikov tomorrow morning. So if we go to bed early, we should be able to load early and head wherever that load's going. No idea where it'll be headed. The further away, the better. Unfortunately, I'm guessing Richmond as well, but I'm hoping it's not. I'm hoping it's further. Hopefully, hopefully it's east. East or north? Much prefer east or north than west. Just because it's highways, we don't drive as often. drive this way very often either. We're on the highway creepy. Southbound from Salmo to Fruitvale. Our Garmin when it when it says highway 3B sounds like Garmin is saying creepy. Highway creepy. Um, climbing up uh, Kootenai Pass, a couple places where there was shade kind of caught me off guard where all of a sudden I was spinning out. I 
uh, very quickly take the foot off the throttle, put in my power divider lock and my uh, differential axle locks and then get moving again at low speed and try not to lose traction. So at night, Cootie Pass will still be very slippery at night. Yeah, the parking, the brake check parking lot and the road closure parking lot. We pulled over just to let all the cars pass first because there's no point of having all those cars behind us going down a mountain slowly. Let them all pass. We'll be at the back of the line. They'll close the road again. No crazy cars trying to pass me the whole way down. Worked out really well. I let a couple of big rigs pass too. I'm like, you look lighter than me, you go ahead. Grad, 2017. Nope, 70 ahead. Reflections off the windshield with this bright sunshine. Six feet for the corner. I guess this would be the north end of Fruitvale. I think. Just around the corner here on the right hand side. We've picked up there and it's always a wide load. Veneer. You usually get a load of veneer from here. Well, we might get a load of veneer, who knows? I think our permit's still good. 50. Can't remember when that permit expires. I'll have to look at our email. We never printed it out or anything, it's just in our email. There we go, Fruitvale. Set cruise control. Must have internet again. Your cell phone's beeping away. I'm going to turn cruise control off because I don't know if I want to do speed limit here. Turn right on Never know what the bus is going to do. Left. See? Highway 3B. 3B. Creepy. No, that's right. Highway crosses the railroad here. Turn right at the stop sign, then take the second left. Turn left on Highway 3. No trains. Continue on Highway 3. Continue on Highway Creepy.
downhill apparently because we're gaining speed. 60 only starts there. Definitely a very uh, narrow and winding road here. Kind of a fun highway to drive. <clears throat> like avoid that pothole. Still 60 here and I'm gaining speed so let's downshift. Bird Road. And then this just kind of blends right into trail. The housing never stops. One of those towns where you don't really know where one starts and the other ends, or where one ends and the other starts. Whatever. Well guys, that's Fruitvale. We're gonna see if we can get unloaded here and see what it's next. If we can't get unloaded here, we're gonna have to spend the night here in a small little yard. Eh, that'll be fine. No, no cell service there where we're unloading, so we're gonna have to go to the old fashioned and keep, keep ourselves busy in other ways. Do play color in the uh, adult coloring book? Yeah. yeah, that might be fun. Or do some mazes. We got some difficult mazes to do. Yeah, might go the old paper and pencil and pen way if we're stuck here. I don't think we will be, but you never know. So hit that thumbs up. We'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching.